Hey guys, Andrew with the Chopping Block here. This is uh, TTM Spartan Level 3 Plus um, ATC Arma Ply. We've shot it with a lot of things that it wasn't intended to stop. And it's done a really good job so far. So I'm going to shoot it with some more stuff that it's not really intended to stop. Well, looks like that's this guy. <laughs> it's the only one that's significantly larger than all these other holes. So we got a little bit of back face deformation here. That's the side, that's the side that it hit. <laughs> you can see that there's dramatically less back face deformation from a steel plate than there is from a ceramic plate. Again, looks like it contained all of it. The coating has blistered up a little bit, but that probably has a lot more to do with the multiple rounds of 50 grain TSX that I shot into this on an earlier test. You can see <laughs> wow, it's cracked. That's, that's steel right there. Yeah. Look at that. So the, the, so it cracked four, the, plate. the 450 Marlin cracked the plate? Well, oh, well, the com combination of the... To be fair, the crack originated where the M855A1 struck the plate in the first place. The M855A1 hit here, where that is, and went right through. And those those cracks originated where the M855A1 hit it. Now, the 450 Marlin hit here, and you can see it put a pretty good hurt on the plate. But, but, it, didn't, but it didn't go through. No, it did not go through. And it looks it looks as though these cracks were probably probably existed in the plate before, but we couldn't see them because of the coating. And once again, thank you to the Target Man Spartan Armor Systems for providing the plate for testing. I sure appreciate your support. Thanks a lot. <laughs>